Hey, g'day, it's Ray here again. Um, I'm doing a job out at uh, Taitapu in New Zealand. Um, I am cleaning off mould and lichen from a Oamaru stone. Uh, here's a quick tip on how to identify and remove uh, lichen, algae, moss, mould, mildew. Um, I went down to Mita 10 Mega and grabbed these outdoor products here. Um, this outdoor cleaner that gets off the the uh, mold that you can see. Uh, if you look, there is difference between um, a clean bit of stone and stone with uh, mildew on it. You can see all the all the black mildew on here, and you can see this bit bit of stone without it. Um, this outdoor cleaner. Is perfect for uh, removing that mildew as opposed to spray and walk away or otherwise known as no more scrubbing or rinsing you spray it on the likes of lichen which is what this this looks like lichen was was on these uh, window seals here and I've sprayed them with that spray and walk away and I leave it for a week and come back and then hopefully it's it's all been removed. It was worse than this, but seems to be getting um, getting rid of it slowly. Uh, this this uh, outdoor cleaner works instantly, and this you leave for a week. Um, so I've used this to remove the mildew, uh, as you can see, algae, moss, mold, and mildew, as it doesn't have uh, active ingredients to remove, unlike this spray and walk away lichen treats lichen treats moss treats mold um, I noticed generally at this job that uh, there's usually mildew or um, mildew is black and mold is white or it's the other way around anyway um, generally on Oamaru stone as you can see I've done a patch here where there's still remnants of mildew mold and where the outdoor cleaner has cleaned it up beautifully um, so this is another quick tip and I'm gonna seal it with Equilux after I've cleaned this whole this whole uh, gable and the middle of this panel and, and the rest of the job 